Fairmont Hotels and Resorts, International Marketing. Fairmont began in 1907 with the opening of its first hotel and resort, the Fairmont San Francisco in the United States. It soon became the city's venue of choice for glittering balls and presidential visits. After its expansion into several other U.S. cities, it was purchased in 1999 by the Canadian Pacific Company. Motivated to expand on an international level, Fairmont has established over 56 destinations in over 16 countries. Fairmont Hotels has recognized is recognized for their uniquely designed properties that stipulate an authentic feel as well as culturally based activities that will suit the need of every customer in any given country. In fact, they are known to go that extra mile to ensure that guests experience the ultimate luxury in travel and exciting new adventures by explore, exploring cultural as well as traditional aspects. The company uses a combination of two segmentation strategies, including a geographic and psychographic strategy. The geographic strategy segments each hotel according to its specific location, meaning each hotel's design, layout, and amenities are influenced by its location's culture and atmosphere. A psychographic strategy focuses on dividing customers according to their social class and lifestyle. Fairmont hotels are known for their luxury and class, and therefore are marketed towards consumers with higher disposable incomes, which belong to a higher social class. Fairmont hotels, no matter where they are, are luxuri luxurious, timeless, and sophisticated. Fairmont positions all its hotels to be the best in the world, offering an experience like no other hotel can. It is a top-tier hotel chain and specialize specializes in offering the client an exceptional guest experience that is uniquely Fairmont. As a hotel chain, the products that it offers are mostly intangible, meaning customers are paying to receive an incredible stay while experiencing excep exceptional customer service by the hotel staff. For Fairmont, the diverse weather conditions in which it operates in positively contributes to the whole experience of its guests. However, natural disasters, although possible anywhere in the world, are more likely and common in certain areas compared to others, making climate a challenge for several of its location, locations. Another challenge Fairmont faces is living up to its name and branded image. The company is known for being a luxurious chain which is inspired by the culture of the country it resides in. However, developing a consistent Fairmont theme and service which reflects the culture and appeals to guests can and has been challenging. Fairmont also faces a challenge in ensuring guest security and safety. Whether from a natural disaster or from an act of violence, Fairmont is responsible for the safety of its guests, many of which are of, high, of higher social status. In the hotel industry, competition is a large concerning factor, specifically in countries like the United States where the hospitality market is mature and saturated. When entering into the international markets, several political barriers exist which can make it difficult for organizations to operate. Issues like corruption, unjust laws and regulations, and political instability can all act as barriers to entering new markets internationally. A prime reason Fairmont has been so successful on a global scale is because of its ability to take advantage of its targeted destination's best assets. The hotel chain has mastered the art of highlighting the best features of a destination has to offer and incorporating its features into its hotels. Fairmont hotels have earned a substantial amount of awards in the past decade, all recognizing a variety of hotel chains' accomplishments. For example, Fairmont has been awarded the Green Leadership Award, Canada's Top 100 Employers of 2011, Cause and Action Award, Chain Leadership Award, Overall Innovation, and the Worldwide Hospitality Awards, just to name a few. The Fairmont Company has experienced great success in several different areas of the hotel industry. In its history of operation, it has not faced significant failures in terms of market share loss. However, the company has experienced opportunity loss for several years. When considering the growth of emerging markets, which has been on the rise for the last two decades, Fairmont has experienced significant opportunity loss by only entering into the emerging markets recently. Fairmont also has disappointed many when it failed to rebuild its property in New Orleans following the Hurricane Katrina. The Fairmont in New Orleans was seen as being a classic grand hotel which was loved by many. Current international expansion strategies in include 
includes identifying landmark and iconic property and destinations and inquiring them. Fairmont should continue with this international growth strategy and continue to identify potential growth by conducting their research in terms of the country's geography, people, government, economy, and communication and infrastructure proven to be a uh, presented as a great opportunity, the Asian and Middle Eastern markets, specifically Qatar and Thailand. Uh, Qatar has prospered in the last several years and will allow Fairmont to dist distribute its presence in the Middle East, whereas Thailand has enjoyed a solid economic growth of over 4% in the last eight years, and its stock market is expected to continue to experience high growth in 2011. By establishing new properties in these two markets, Fairmont would be capitalizing on the country's high tourism as well as continuing to establish its international presence. The main lessons and conclusions that were pulled from this report was one, how to adapt when going abroad while at the same time maintaining a certain standard. Two, proper mar market research and data collection are immensely important when venturing abroad because as conditions are different, it may lead to significant implications which the firm must prepare and plan for. And lastly, it was learnt that emerging markets have great potential for international growth and offer great opportunity for future expansion. Thank you.